Hello and welcome to composition class. Wanted to spend just a few minutes going over the platform, the Canvas platform, the learning management system that we'll be using this semester. All of the inf information that we cover face to face, you'll have access via uh, this learning platform. So if you sign in, you'll come to the syllabus page, which gives you kind of an overview. I will um, upload a little bit later the the full syllabus. You'll have a link to that. Uh, what appears here is just a snapshot view, but feel free to go through and look at this information. And uh, basically this is a 16-week course for those who are studying a four-year bachelor's degree program to be English teachers. So this is a course that covers both academic English as well as creative writing. So you'll be asked to complete two essays as well as uh, write some poems towards the end of the semester. We'll also cover some uh, business correspondence, so you'll have some uh, exposure to drafting letters and uh, different types of business-related documents, which will also include a um, online resume. So here you'll see um, some general information about the course. Again, uh, it's recommended that you have between a B1, B2 English level proficiency according to the common European framework. And the rest of the information, I think you can uh, just take a look at it yourself. There's a calendar on the right hand side, so any assignments that will be posted that will, you'll be asked to complete, you'll be able to refer to those assignments, those due dates, via this calendar. You also have the, uh, the breakdown of the grades and the way associated uh, with each of those categories. And you'll also want to take a look at, on the left-hand side of your screen, the different sections, attendance, grades, everything will be kept and maintained in this uh, learning management system. Modules and assignments, these, uh, these are the two main pages that you'll probably access the most. It basically gives you two different uh, ways of viewing information. So modules, you'll notice that information is broken down by a week, whereas assignments, they are broken down by units. Again, a lot of this information is the same information, it's just different ways of accessing it. You might also decide to access certain pages of this, uh, of this, uh, of this platform. So if you go into pages and view all pages, you'll have access to all of the pages organized uh, alphabetically and discussions this is where uh, the discussions will reside and if we have any quizzes the quizzes you'll be able to access here if you want to contact anyone in the course whether it be classmates or if you want to contact me directly you can click on people and send messages directly and uh, th this would be the preferred way that I would like if you need to reach out to me send me a message I would prefer I would prefer that you do that uh, using the platform. I'm not going to click on it at this point because there are some listings with emails that I don't want to uh, show at this time. Here we have files, so any files that we access, you can uh, find them here. A syllabus as well, you can access the syllabus. Conferences and collaborations, we will not be using much at all. Uh, if we do, I will discuss it in class how we're going to use it. So that's basically it. Um, if, when you're signing in the first time, uh, you will want to access the website learn.canvas.net. You'll notice that the address that I'm accessing is canvas.instructure.com. That's for uh, teachers. But if you're a student, again, you can access your class by going to learn.canvas.net. So I hope this helps. If you have any issues getting into your class, feel free to send me an email. Those of you who are studying uh, for credit, feel free to come by my office if you have any issues, uh, especially accessing the same information using your mobile device. I look forward to getting started and we'll talk to you soon.